Hello again, YouTube. This is a Woman's World 123. I want to do a quick review of what um, I think about the Smith & Wesson 442 Airweight um, Revolver. I'm not going to do a tabletop review because there's a lot of videos out there right now that you guys can go to to actually get a thorough review of this particular handgun. I do want to mention that this is a hammerless um, handgun and it's a snub nose 38 Special. Um, of course, you can see it's a revolver, so there's no need in me keep, uh, to, uh, for me to keep saying that, but my first impression of this particular handgun after shooting it was it has a long, hard trigger pull, and I'm, I'm assuming like with most um, pocket guns or purse guns or concealable uh, s guns that you're going to be putting in your purse or pocket, it has that long trigger pull just in case something gets snagged on it. It has to have a certain amount of pressure on that particular trigger to uh, make the gun fire. So that's a good thing. But when you're shooting it, it's very uncomfortable um, as it is with the, um, that, my, my, um, bodyguard but my first impression of this gun is it's really nice lightweight gun it can fit into your pocket or your purse and you don't have to worry about snagging it on um, the hammer because there is no hammer so it's hammerless the um, grips are uh, very high quality rubber grip so I mean it feels pretty good in your hand um, other than that when I was shooting it it has a pretty decent sight picture as you can tell and it's not bad to not have um, an actual adjustable rear sight or adjustable front sight. But uh, for a belly gun, this is definitely a, a decent gun to, um, to actually own. I would recommend it for any woman that's looking for a purse gun or um, a concealed carry gun or even a guy that's looking for a pocket gun. It has a lot of power, which means that you will have a lot of stopping power if someone does try you or test you. You don't have to worry about it not um, being a sufficient enough bullet to stop a um, um, uh, criminal or anything of that nature. But I really like the gun, and that was my first impression of it. It feels good in my hand. It's um, lightweight, easy to use, concealable, and um, I actually like it. So I'm going to give you guys a couple of shots of me at the uh, range shooting this. Um, it's not a, a really good picture of me shooting it, but I just want to give you guys my first impression. And that's pretty much it with this gun. Thank you for viewing A Woman's World Out.